Hi Raiders, Chris Hill here, your Fine Arts Assistant, and I'm proud to be introducing this year's Fine Arts Week Showcase. Now 2020 has thrown us for a loop, and we can't celebrate physically, but we are going to celebrate the arts at Creighton Durham Hall virtually. And so, I now give you the digital Fine Arts Week Showcase. Here comes the art! Theater has changed me because it's given me a place to call home and a safe place to express myself and find great joy. The community is so amazing and I've loved every minute of it. Throughout this pandemic, I have found myself singing quite a lot. It just helps me feel less stressed and it makes me happy. Through this pandemic, the arts have given me an opportunity to do what I love the most. It's given me time to play and listen to music. Um, and doing that has acted as not only an emotional coping mechanism, but also as something to do when I'm bored. Art provides an opportunity to share creativity in millions of ways. I enjoy photography because it can help capture people, places, and most importantly, moments. These moments can help me remember the joy and happiness that I've experienced in life. Art is important to me and it has helped me, uh, especially during this time, because it brings a lot of peace and comfort and it helps you think about things in a way that I don't think you'd be able to if you weren't making art about it. I'm most proud of my graphic design projects, which include a portrait and a flyer. This is a portrait I made of musical artist Juice World. Theater has made me an entirely new person. Ever since I took acting one junior year, I've become much more confident in my public speaking abilities and my opinions in general. And I've learned the importance of being my authentic self unapologetically. Hi everyone. A few ways that I've been trying to stay busy throughout this pandemic is attempting to learn how to play the guitar, uh, reading a play a day, and creating content as a teaching artist for the Ordway education team. Before the arts, I was a very shy kid and I didn't like being the center of attention. But after I joined choir and theater, I became more comfortable with people noticing me and I used that to start sharing my opinions and start expressing myself. Art, specifically ceramics, has helped me to take a deep breath and relax during the day while enjoying the process of creating versus just the final outcome. I feel very centered when I'm creating art and I'm very proud of my pieces. The arts have helped me get through the pandemic through photography, and that's something I always love doing, but I usually do nature landscapes and portraits, but that's something I haven't been able to do when I'm stuck inside, but that's led me to try some new things that I've really enjoyed. My favorite project that I've done so far is a series of self-portraits using a camera tripod and a timer, and I've done that all around my house and outside, and it's been really fun trying something new. <laughs> Music has always been a safe place for me. Whether it's singing or listening to songs, it's something I love to do. And during this pandemic, it's really helped me calm myself and realize that all I can do is just be patient. Eli, what accomplishments are you most proud of in ceramics? I'm most proud of the Jordan 1 I made this year just because it's really realistic. Uh, Maggie, how does art make you feel? can get really stressful but just going to ceramics and hopping on the wheel has really helped me to unwind and relax and kind of just like find peace in myself. As the compulsive talker I am, theater has taught me one very important thing and that is when to know when to be quiet. Sometimes the most powerful moments in a show are the ones in which there are no words. So for me, I feel like art takes me to a place where I can express myself. And it sounds very cliche, but whether I'm painting or I'm drawing or I'm doing something involved in the theater, being able to express my emotions and my personality in a creative way is so refreshing. Choir has taken me to such a safe place and understanding that it's okay to have a different singing voice than everybody else. And also it's changed hopefully my singing voice for the better, but also the mindset to be yourself through music and just to put your own personality to your voice.